Yo, what is up everyone, and welcome back to another video. My name is Joshua Winkins, and in this video, I want to go over how to create this really cool money transition effect in Final Cut Pro 10. So you can see right here, this is what the effect looks like. You have this really cool um, money border right here, over a $100 bill border, and then you have this $1 bill transition, and then you have these really cool little money effects right here, and then a transition of a $100 bill. And that's basically everything that comes in this pack. Now this pack is from Cinepax, but don't worry, it's free, so go ahead and go down in, in the description below, and the download link will be there, so if you want to actually download this pack, it's from Cinepax, but don't worry, it, it doesn't cost anything. So let's head over here to the example right here, and I'll basically go over how to create this effect. So what you want to do is you want to head over um, to the $1 bill transition. So here we go, here is the $1 bill transition right here. So basically what you're going to try to do is you're trying to find the opening right here so it's going to go frame by frame until we kind of find the opening right here so let's just keep going frame by frame until see the crack is right there but the opening happens right there so as you can see right here we'll go frame by frame and then the opening happens right there so we'll place a marker right here and we'll put it right here so as you can see right there as soon as the opening happens there we go, we've transitioned into the next clip right here. Same thing with the $100 bill. So let's apply the effect over here. And let's kind of go with the $100 bill um, right here. So we're basically going to go like this until we see an opening right here. As you can see right there, there is the opening right here. So we'll place a marker right here. As you can see, here's the opening right here. So as you can see right here. We play the effect um, right here. We'll close it up right there. And then we'll wait till the opening happens, which is right here. And there we go. We've transitioned into the next clip right here. What we'll also do is we could add a money border right here or animated frames right here. We could take the animated frames right there. And we can also go ahead and copy them and put the animated frames again right here. So we're basically just looping them right here. Go ahead and use the blade tool right there and there you go you've created some animated frames um, right here so what we're going to do too is then we could add this right here we could take this wipe and we could put it right here and then we could actually change the rotation to negative um, 90 right here so we'll go ahead and actually i'll, I'll increase the scale too to about 180 percent so let's go ahead and play it right here and as you can see right there, this is what the effect looks like right here. You have this money effect kind of raining down. And there you go, you kind of created this effect right here. So let's go ahead and play it right here. And this is what the effect looks like right here. You got the animated bars, and then you have the money transition with the money effects right here. And then you have the $100 bill transition. So that's basically how you um, create the effect um, right here. And that's pretty much all you do. That's pretty much exactly what I did. Now I did a couple really cool effects when it came to this thing right here. So I'll go ahead and I'll just basically show you how to do it. Actually, I'll, I'll use this one as an example right here. So I'll go ahead and press option right here. And this bottom one right here, I'm going to head over here to the color board. Create a new color board right here. Go to the exposure. You want to crank up the exposure. You want to crank up the saturation and then you can change the color to whatever you want let's just say we want it blue right here now what you want to do is head to blur right here take the focus and you want to apply the blur or apply the uh, blur on the bottom clip right here so as you can see right here you have created this really cool money glow effect right here here is the clip i'll just able to disable the bottom clip right here the top clip is just a normal clip but if we disable the top clip right here, there we go. We have added a color board where we've increased the exposure, increase the saturation, and then change the color right here. And then we've added a blur effect right here. And that's how you create that really cool glow effect. Now, of course, you can uh, you can uh, you could copy those settings or copy that effect to every single one of those different transitions. But I just want to show you how to do it. Remember, copy it. The bottom one has a blur effect with the exposure saturation turned up, and the color board changed to whatever color you want. And that's basically how you create the effect right here. And of course, you can copy that to every single one of your transitions right here. And there you go. You create this really cool. 
um, money rip transition. So again, you have the animated frames right here. Then you have the $1 bill wipe. You want to wait until the first opening happens, the transition. Um, and then right here, I just changed the rotation and the scale for that effect right here. And again, the same thing. You want to wait until there is an opening right here to start your transition right here. And that's how you create the effect right here. And again, we'll go over here. As you can see right here, um, color and blur. I did apply the same thing with a color board and then a focus board, all that, just in case you want the really cool, um, that really cool glowing outline. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you found it helpful and informative. If you're new to this channel, I upload Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials every single day at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So if you enjoy these types of videos, consider hitting that subscribe button. That's the Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial playlist with over 130 Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials. See you in the next one. Peace.